today we were working on, again, left spin concepts, but we were working on a shoulder catch. So version one, which is one that most of us have done before, the hand cap only goes to right above the shoulder. On count four, I find a forward connection point. Dan's careful not to press down. He's gonna cross in front as he hand changes five on six, then we anchor seven and eight. From there, we did a double head loop, so Dan prepped, prepped, payload me under himself, then anchor we go away. Yes, everybody cool on that? Mm -hmm. Okay, so then we have the flat back. So on the flat back, the seven is key for the men to get to this strong split weight stance. The other key is don't hand change, guys, right? So when we get to one, two, three, and four, five, six, notice on seven, he hasn't gone yet. Then he'll go under four, eight, nine, and 10, whatever you need to do to get back by 10. Men, if you're still under on 10 and you need 11, 12, by all means, right? Maybe there's something elongated in the music. So you can take as long as you need right now. So, so it goes one, two, three, and four. We have a five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, then we started from right to right. We're going into a pinwheel now. So this time on count four, Dan faces me. He steps across the track. He uses his free hand to catch that free shoulder. As he comes forward and under on the five, He's gonna quickly, quickly switch to my rib cage. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. So the idea is that he's gotta curve us into circular movement. I can't do it, I'm the follower. So he's gotta make that change for me. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. We go as long as we want. Okay, we're going. 